But first, a word from our sponsor. Thank you so much to Casetify for sponsoring today's video. If you guys know me even a little bit, you know that my phone always has a Casetify phone case on it. This is the one that I have been rocking recently. You may have seen it in my recent videos or on my Instagram. Literally, I'm obsessed with it. I love Casetify. Truly one of my favorite brands. There are so many different styles to choose from, thousands of them. And if you don't like any of them somehow, which I just simply don't believe you if you say that, but I mean, you can also customize your own phone case on their website, which is really freaking cool. So literally there is something for everybody. I love these cases. I love that you can have both incredible protection for your phone and a super cute case. The impact cases have military grade drop protection and I trust this case with my life. I trust this case more than I trust most people, honestly. Another thing that I love is that you get 10 free sanitizing wipes in a pack with every order from Caseify, which is really, really nice because it's so important to be sanitizing your phone, you're touching your phone, and your phone is touching your face, and your phone is touching a lot of things all day, every day. So it's really important to keep it sanitary. Case of I also has masks that they're selling. I have a few of them. They're great. They're cloth masks. You can put a filter in there. There's an insert for it. So that's fantastic as well. If you want to try out Caseify and you want to get 20% off, go to this URL. The link will be in the description box below and get 20% off. We love a good sale. Again, thank you so much to Caseify for sponsoring today's video. I love you guys so and now let's get into the video. Oh, work. All right, Harry, sir. I'm so sorry, but you, my friend, we're gonna have to move. Anywho, what's up, you guys? It's Hannah. Welcome back to my channel, and welcome back to another vlog. Today, Gwen and I and you guys will be spending some time together. I'm gonna be running some errands today. I'm gonna try and prepare for back to school. Obviously we are in unprecedented times. As of right now, my school said that we're going back and doing like in-person classes, but my brother is going to be a freshman at Penn State. He has five classes and three of them have been moved online, but they're still like sending them back to school. Like he's still gonna be moving in and living in his dorm and stuff. I just feel like it's very all over the place with what schools are doing. I did out of curiosity ask on my Instagram story to vote if your school is going back in person or online. 43% said in person and 57% said online. So I don't even know how to prepare for this. I don't know how to tell you to prepare for this because I don't think any of us know what's going on. So as, as of right now, I'm going back in person. However, I am a commuter student, so I'm literally just gonna go to class and then come home and like do all my work at home. So I feel like I can give you guys the best of both worlds. I am gonna be doing some supply shopping today. I'm not gonna be doing a haul in this video because I'm going to be doing my annual what's in my backpack slash school supplies haul that is coming up. You know that I would never not do that. That's like literally the video that a lot of people have found me by and this will be my third year doing it which is crazy. But anything else that I get that is not school supplies related, I will show you what I'm getting but I wanted to vlog me just kind of shopping around and trying to find some stuff for back to school today. I think we should get going. I am going to stop at Dunkin' first. I feel like I can't run errands if I don't go to Dunkin' first, so. Hi, could I get a medium iced coffee with butter pecan and cream, please? Um, the, the butter pecan has actually been discontinued. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I know. I'm sorry about that. I, I'm mad about it too. That's heartbreaking. Can I get hazelnut swirl instead? Sure. Anything else? That's it. Hey, your total is going to be 3.17. Um... Duncan, if you're watching this, what the f the butter pecan flavor has been discontinued. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Hi, good, how are you? Do you need your seat? No, thanks. You have an essay? Thanks, you too. I like don't even know like what to say right now. I was rocking with the butter pecan for a while because it was really, really good. I'm just gonna listen to some really sad music now. I got murdered. Oh my gosh! I meant to bring something I have to return and I forgot it. Damn it! That's inconvenient. Guess I'm just gonna have to come back to Target. Wow. I'm gonna switch over to my phone now. All right, let's go. This is the mask of the day. It says yikes on it. Because that's how I feel. Got it from Redbubble. Okay, let us go. Take me on this journey home. I don't wanna wait no Let me 
me to the honeymoon Tell me you'll be on real soon I don't wanna wait no more They literally never have these in stock I am so excited It's going all the way As long as I'm safely in your arms And it don't really matter where we stay Don't pass, babe Space makes me sad freaking lord i am sweating like a bear probably because i have sweatpants on not my smartest move when it's uh it says it's 86 degrees i don't believe it the humidity is off the charts astronomical i don't really feel like hooking my camera up to my tripod right now i bought so much stuff i was expecting to have to go to other stores because i wasn't sure that i was going to be able to find everything that i wanted at target but i did so it is now 12 38 i haven't eaten since breakfast and i just had a bowl of cereal for breakfast i don't really feel like making food at my house and i kind of want chipotle might have to order chipotle pickup are you kidding me Let's begin with my Target haul. This is a wall organizer. Got this to hang up in my, oh f I got this to hang up in my office area. I'm really excited about this because I really wanted to be able to keep my desk like as clutter free as possible because I hate it when my desk just has stuff on it in general. Like that, it's so annoying to me and it overwhelms me. So I'm gonna try and make sure that I can keep it as clear as possible. So I got this. It's a metal pocket and wall mount or tabletop use. Yeah, no, I got this and I have a vision. I ended up getting these two wreath hangers. And what I wanna do is hang these on the side of my desk because I have a piece of wood that goes like around it like this, kind of in the middle. And I wanted to hang these from one of the sides and then put this in these little things. It's gonna fit, I just don't wanna jam it in right now. I tried it already. I'm just trying to maximize the space and I don't know why, but I love small space organization. Like if you look that up on Pinterest, it's just so satisfying how people can fit so much stuff in creative ways in a small space. I don't know, I just really enjoy that. So I that's probably why I'm so excited about this. Another thing I got, hand sanitizer. I got a bigger one so that I could refill my smaller bottles that I'm gonna keep with me throughout the year. I'm gonna skip over everything that is school supplies related because I don't wanna spoil my video, which is like one of my favorite videos to freaking film, so I don't wanna spoil it. Um, This is not school supplies, but I freaking found these pajamas. They are so soft. It's a matching set, so it has this top in this pretty pink color, and it comes with shorts. This is my favorite combination to sleep in. There was no actual reason why I needed that. I didn't need it at all, but I saw it and it was very cute and there was one left in my size, so. I got two bottles of my dry shampoo because I'm out. And then I got this and I'm so excited about this for no reason. Like it's not even an exciting product. So this is a computer monitor stand. I am gonna put my iMac monitor on this thing. Again, 
small space storage and organization so this will be sitting on my desktop and then i'll have this drawer that i can pull out and put stuff in and then the last thing that i got that is not school supplies related is uh this notebook let me look at my one two three four five six seven i have seven notebooks on my bookshelf right now but yet and there's a good reason for this because look at it are you freaking kidding me go get them tiger I love this. It is so cute. I love the colors. I'm obsessed. The tigers are like furry. So I think that this is going to be my new YouTube notebook. So that is what I got from Target. I'm really, really excited to get into my office area and get it ready for the school year and declutter a little bit. And I feel like I'll feel a lot better once I do. All right. So now I think I'm going to go ahead and clean my room. It looks like a tornado went through it. Yeah. So let's get to clean. day so as you saw yesterday i basically cleaned my room i mean i still have to go through and declutter and get rid of stuff but I mean, you can see the floor so that's progress that's the progress that we needed i am really looking forward to today i'm really excited to try and organize my desk clutter it and get it ready for school and to do stuff with the things that i bought yesterday so that is the plan for today i also have to edit but that's irrelevant to this video i just put my hair back in literally the same braids because i'm trying to try train my hair so that I don't have to wash it every day and if I don't put it in braids it gets unbelievably greasy literally like the day after I wash it so I've been trying to use my dry shampoo and then just put it in braids so that I'm not like combing through it all day and it can maybe not get as oily so I don't have to wash it all the time yeah so welcome to today I think I'm gonna make some lunch and then I'm gonna get started on organizing my office space organizing my desk area probably showing you guys my organization tips for my desk and home office space and all of that i'm really excited about it because i am passionate about my bedroom office area passionate about it so Drill holes. Step one, drill holes. I think I might need to take a trip to Target because I need another one of these bins. When I bought these, when I was first doing this entire area, there were only three. I want to get another one to go 
on top of it because I have stuff to put in there. I don't want to keep these markers in this bin where it says markers, tape, and labels because I use these every day to mark off my calendar. So I'm trying to figure out what would be... Can I put them there? Is that a thing? Okay, I'm just going to stick them there for right now. This container I took from my desk and then whenever my dad comes to help me hang this up because you have to drill a hole in the wall and I was not ready for that. And I probably could do it on my own, but I just don't think he would trust me with his power tools. So whenever I do that, I'm going to transfer some of these pens and pencils and markers and stuff into here just so I could get this off of my desk. Are you kidding me? Dude, they have this set of five that are pink. That's the only option I'm seeing. I mean, this one is broken. No, this is the one that's broken, I think. Oh my God, they're both broken? Damn. I wanted to get a new trash can too because mine is disgusting, so. So I think I'm gonna probably just go to Target and grab these bins in pink and a trash can and probably some kombucha or something. Oh, oh my God. Sweat is sweating. It's not right. All right. I got them. Um... If you're an OG of this channel, probably recognize this. They changed their label, but oh, that hits so different. Okay, so what we need to do is basically see if we can perform surgery and remove these labels and reattach them to the new bins. If not, I can make new ones, but I'm gonna see if I can reuse them. Okay, let's see what we can do. Okay, nope. Damn, those there's a really stuck on there. Got it. Okay. Well, whatever. We tried. She don't want roses to bloom. She's so bulletproof with those eyes. All my attention's on you. It's the little things. It's the little things. Necessary. This is so stupid. Take some time to get acquainted. I ain't saying I'm going to be as good as it's going to get. I literally don't even know how I caught that, but I am so grateful that I did. The love of God, do not fall. Thank you. Been a Saturday, I show you. You just need love. You know, I probably have stuff once school starts, so I should probably leave room for that. Okay, so I want to show you guys what my setup in here is like right now. I just kind of finished trying to do a little bit of organization. So as you guys saw, we hung this wall organizer that I got from Target. So far, I just put this notepad in here. I have shown this in videos before. It's from Amazon. I really like to use this during the school year and just writing out everything I need to do for the entire week. And then I think that I'm going to rip each sheet off and put them on this. And then I put the markers that I use to cross off my calendar and also to write my to-do list right here because I had them sitting right here next to this little organizer but I just had no idea. I don't know. It just mm, didn't feel right. I just stuck them here and they fit here perfectly and then I have all of my writing utensils in this basket thing. I used to have my writing utensils right here in an organizer but I really wanted to try and have like this is the extent to which I want things on my desk. I really don't want there to be clutter. Whatever I could get rid of and put somewhere else I wanted to do that. Here is my desk. Yesterday my dad helped me to finally put this knob here that I got forever 
forever ago just because I wanted to add some flair or whatever to the desk. So I got this off of Etsy. I think it was really nice and I think that it complements the desk really well. So then I put this monitor stand here yesterday as well that I got from Target and then in the drawer so far, I don't really have anything important. I just put my snacks there and the extra red pens that I don't even need. Like I don't know where I'm gonna put those. I just stuck them there for right now. Another thing that I like is that I can push my keyboard under this and it fits perfectly. So if I need to use my laptop or something, I have all this open space for it. I have a picture frame of me and my grandpa. And then this Bible verse down here is part of the reading that I read at his funeral. And I really, really like that verse. And I think that it just brings me peace when I think about him. I wasn't trying to get emotional or anything, but I don't think I've talked about it on YouTube yet. No, I haven't. I talked about it on Instagram, but don't follow me on Instagram. You probably won't know that my grandpa passed away a couple weeks ago. We were really, really close. A big reason of why I went a couple weeks without posting, well, not in a row, but when I said that I didn't have a video for that week, there was a lot going on and that was a really big part of it. I have a picture of him on my desk because I just think that I have a lot of the characteristics that he had. He was very, very hardworking and honestly like my biggest hype man and always very proud of me. And I know that I just want to make him proud. So I like to look at that when I'm doing whatever work. I just like to, you know, keep those thoughts in my mind. And this picture frame is from the Heart Department Co. on Etsy. I'm obsessed with them. This thing is also from them. They're amazing. I highly suggest you check them out. And then I have my iced coffee, which slaps so hard. I had this hanging thingy that I put on this strip of wood right here yesterday. I actually thought that it would be a good idea to move it over here because let me actually like get down. Okay, I'm under my desk right now. I had this hanging right here. But then I thought, well, my power strip is over here and all of my cords and charging stuff is here. And previously when I wanted to hook my laptop and my iPad up to their chargers, I would literally just stick them right here on my desk because then it would end up taking up space. But it was really the only surface that I had to put them on unless I wanted to put them on the floor to charge them. So I decided to take their charging cords and like weave them behind there and put them in here to charge. And I think that is such a good idea on my part. That's probably what I'm going to be using these for. And then that also frees up space from my bookshelf because I had my laptop and my iPad previously just sitting right there so that I could just grab them. But I mean, if I can just store them in this thing, it's still pretty easy to grab because it's just right under my desk and I can charge them conveniently. That's what I ended up doing with that. So I'm really, really happy that I got this stuff from Target the other day because it is proving to be very useful. Moving over here, we have my bookshelf. I got these new bins from Target and I'm happy that I did because two out of the three bins that I previously had here are broken so I was meaning to get new ones anyway so I got five of these in a pack for five dollars and then I made labels as you guys saw yesterday put them on there I love my freaking label maker so much I'm obsessed with labeling things that looks really nice and organized and I'm really happy with it this shelf I have another organizing thing with a bunch of office supplies and whatever that I'm probably going to be grabbing for a lot when school starts down here is like the actual books part of the bookshelf over here I have notebooks and this is the cute go get them tiger one that you guys saw and then over here is textbooks that I I have bought for classes in the past that I thought would be useful for my future career, so I kept them. But textbooks that I'm gonna buy for this coming school year, I'm also gonna put on this side. Honestly, I am really happy with the way that this bookshelf is set up right now. There's really not any clutter at all. It just feels so clean. So that is that. And I don't even know like what more I could do in my desk space at this point because I think I'm making a really good use of my space right now. I get really excited when I can find new ways to make my space feel less cluttered because you never want your desk to feel cluttered, especially when you're working at it all the time, whether you work from home or if you're gonna be doing school remotely this semester and you have online classes. If you have a desk where you do your work, you never want it to be cluttered because it just, at least for me, it, it's so unmotivating. But that is pretty much what I've done for my storage and my organization for my office area in my room. Alrighty, so I changed again because it is a few hours later, but I just wanted to go ahead and end this vlog. I think we made some really good progress today. Well, actually, this has been filmed over three days, but back to school season is upon us. I don't know how this happened so fast. Like, I genuinely feel like I blinked and it's back to school again, but also I feel like YouTubers start doing back to school like halfway through July because that's simply when our grind starts, when our prime season starts. You just have to start hustling early 
because this is truly our season. Anywho, that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I hope you liked it. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you've stayed until this point in the video, comment down below. I'm a real one because you're a real one. If you want to see more videos from me, make sure you hit the subscribe button. I post a new video every single Sunday. And if you forget that I post a new video every single Sunday, or if I decide to post a bonus surprise video, or if you just want to get notified right when I post a new video, because sometimes I don't know what time it's going to be, then make sure you turn on my post notifications for my channel. It's the little bell icon so that you get notified right when I post a new video. Yeah, I think that's it. Hope you guys all have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.